Hey everyone, this is Anubhav from Educational Technology Services. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can record presentations using Zoom and PowerPoint for your classes. So I start off in this Google Chrome tab here, and I always make sure to use all Denison applications using Google Chrome because that's where it works best. So right now I'm in denison.zoom.us and I'm going to sign into my account. And now I'm in the Zoom homepage here. So I'm going to schedule a meeting. That brings us to this page here. So I'm going to enter the meeting details. And you'll find key settings down here. So I want to mute the participations upon entry so that no one is disturbing when someone else is presenting. I want to record the meeting to my computer and I'll invite anyone if that's needed. So I'm going to save this meeting and you can see that you can start the meeting here or from down here. And you can also edit the details in the meeting and you can delete this meeting if needed. Now before I start this meeting, I'm just gonna make sure I have my presentation done. So as you can see, I have my presentation over here. And that's ready to go. So I'm going to go ahead and start this meeting. So if you have the Zoom software on your computer, then you'll get this pop up window. So I'm going to start Zoom meetings. So that brings me to this window here. So now I'm going to join with my audio and I'm also going to start my video. And now we're ready to present. So as you can see, the recording has already started and there's also a indicator here in the top left. And if you are the host, you can pause or stop the recording anytime you want. So now that we're in Zoom, I'm going to go down to share screen. I'm going to click on the PowerPoint window and I'm going to click on share. And as you can see, this brings us to our shared screen and I'm able to make my presentation from here. I can go through the slides and talk as I want, and so can your group members. Once you're done, you can hit the stop share on the top, and you can hit the stop recording on the top left. As you can see, it says that recording files will be converted when the meeting ends, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the meeting. Thank you, and I hope this helps with your presentation.